what's going on youtube your boy wiz back again with a new video man this is an unexpected video we're actually on the iphone today because i don't have the camera on me just getting off of work uh got a little bit of time to kill so decided to just go ahead and pull out my phone and record a quick video so this video is pretty much about Arnold Schwarzenegger and how he refused to work out at the Gold's Gym based on the conditions that he saw and whether or not that same situation or just the aspect everything behind it is something that people who have recently returned to the gym or people like myself who anticipate returning to the gym pretty soon should take into consideration as far as safety is concerned. So a few days ago, Arnold Schwarzenegger went to the Mecca, which is the Gold's Gym in Venice Beach. He went to go work out. And that's pretty much a gym that uh, he kind of helped put on the map as far as, because that's what he used to train at. And just as far as like being popular, people wanting to visit, yada, yada, yada. He goes to the gym and um, I think he goes in, but he doesn't stay long at all because he goes in and he sees that people are working out without masks. Now, I don't need to tell you what's going on. I definitely don't want to address it by name because I heard that they demonetize your video or don't uh, display your video and your video won't get any impressions if you mention the illness that's going on. So I already don't need that. I already have uh, 340 subscribers. So, you know, I don't need lower impressions. But anyway, um, he goes into the gym. He sees that nobody has on a mask. He doesn't feel comfortable and he leaves. Uh, you gotta take into account his personal situation. I mean, the man is 72 years old. As we know, uh, the illness going around tends to affect older people more. So with him being 72 years old, he just didn't feel safe to stay and work out, which I completely understand. So the reason why I'm personally making a video about this today is I just went past the uh, DSW to, you know, give me some work shoes. And my gym is right next to the DSW, my gym, which I haven't worked out at since March the 14th. Yes, I remember the date because it burns in my heart. But anyway, um, I see a note on the gym and I see that, uh, you know, there is the Gold's Gym also, by the way. And there's other Gold's Gyms, probably like 20 to 25, to 30 miles away. It's so like two or three locations. And I see two of the locations that are probably 20 minutes away are currently open so i call up the closest location and lo and behold they answer the phone and say yeah we're open we're 24 hours you know we have a little bit of restrictions as to the number of people that can come in but we haven't really seen a backup there hasn't been any sort of type of weight and these are all questions that i'm asking like you know is there a weight is there a backup is there a limit they just say yeah you just need to walk in and walk out with your mask pretty much you don't need your mask on you know when you're on the floor, which is pretty much the same thing uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger uh, saw where he didn't see people at the gym with their mask on while they were on the floor, which is kind of stupid to me. What's the point of walking in and out uh, with your mask on? I mean, is that for show? Because if you're walking out, you know, about through the location while you're working out, huffing and puffing and doing whatever without a mask, it's just like, what's the difference? If I walk close to the door, if I walk back and forth to the gym, from the front to the back, I mean, what's the difference? Me going outside, outside is safe. You know what I mean? So anyway, it got me to thinking, I'm like, okay, you know, if I want to, I can work out right now. However, I had to stop and think about it for a second. You know, I, I get all type of notifications to my phone and, um, you know, news notifications, YouTube, social media, whatever. And I woke up saying that 23 states have an increase in cases and this and that. But to be honest, I don't know what to believe with the news because the news is saying one thing. But to be honest, if I had to give my honest opinion about the whole situation in reference to the illness, it seems like it's going away. I, the news doesn't say it. They, they don't suggest it, suggest it unless it's Fox News. They like to make it seem like it doesn't exist at all. CNN wants to scare you. There's like no middle ground. But um, anyway, I try to get political, but it seems as though it's going away because everything's opening up around. I'm in Merlin, by the way. So everything's opening up and you don't really see nobody talking about it as much. Only when you cut on the news. So me seeing that notification saying that 23 states are having increases and it was a record number on Sunday as far as uh, total new cases worldwide, I believe. I'm just like, ooh, like I can go to the gym, 
you know, I can start today, I can start tomorrow, I can start this week. But I'm like, maybe I might sit back and wait and see what happens. Because my whole thing is this, as bad as I'm ready to lift and clang and bang, you know, I got kids and I would just hate for me to just see what I'm seeing on the news or at least what I'm hearing and notifications that I'm getting and ignore it and be the one to just rush to the gym. The gym ain't going nowhere, you know. Never thought the gyms were closed for three months, but they didn't go anywhere. They're back, apparently. So I think as bad as I want to go, it may be best to, to do one better than Arnold Schwarzenegger and not even show up to the damn gym and just kind of see how everything plays out. If the numbers go up, if things, you know, reclose. They've been talking about a second wave for months. But then they say that the first wave was never over to begin with. And, you know, people are downplaying it. People are upscaling it. I just don't know what to believe. So I'm thinking about giving it a week or two. So comment below. What do you think? First of all, what state do you live in? Are your gyms open? Did your gyms ever close? I saw gyms like in Texas seem like they never closed. But um, are your gyms open? Do your gyms, uh, you know, have any type of requirements? other than wearing a mask just only when you're walking in and out. Do you feel comfortable working out uh, or do you plan to wait? Let me know all of that in the comments below. So that's where I'm gonna go ahead and end this video. If you did like this video, remember to go ahead and give it a thumbs up and comment. Am I bugging? Should I just go back to the gym and not worry about it? Is this thing even real? I hate to say that because lives have apparently been lost, but some people think that's the case. So like I said, comment below. If you like the vibes I'm giving off, go ahead and subscribe to the boys' channel. We're going to have some content coming up pretty soon, some gym content, whether it's tomorrow, next week, you know. We're about to start working out again, about to start putting out that good, natural bodybuilding content, that real stuff, no fake weights. But, um, yeah, holla at me. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Catch you in the next video. Peace out, baby.